Well, Eric, the SEC spring meetings are taking place in Destin, Florida, and if you thought the most jarring thing would be the sight of John Calipari in an Arkansas polo shirt, you're wrong. The most jarring thing was what he said. You can't just win with freshmen in college basketball. He's finally figured it out. If only somebody had told him that before. <laughs> if only anybody had said that. I think Kentucky fans have only been complaining that this one and done stuff is not is not the best thing since maybe 2015 or 16. But here's the thing. Right after the season, after they're bounced by Oakland in the first round of the NCAA tournament, I was there. John Calipari sat there at the podium after that loss and said, you know, we're not going to change the way we do things. We're still going to go out and get the most talented uh, prospects in the country. That's just what we do and, and get them ready for the NBA and all of that. Something changed. It was something that trip from Lexington to Fayetteville <laughs> has changed it. And I just kind of wonder if your Kentucky fan has been saying this for years or anybody else. What do you think of this change? Yeah, I mean, it proves that he didn't read anything that we wrote or other yeah. people wrote on message boards, and he wasn't listening to talk radio because it's all everybody has been saying for a number of years. In 2015, when Kentucky had the unbeaten team then got beaten in the Final Four, the very next season, Villanova won a national championship with older players like Josh Hart. They did it again in 2018 with another older team. Virginia did it the next year with an older team. Everybody else has seen what's happened. It was just Cal's stubbornness that held the day. It finally cost him his popularity at the University of Kentucky, forcing his move to Arkansas. And now that he's there, if he really has seen the light, and I'm not convinced that he has, it's time that he finally caught up to what everybody else was saying. Or is it hogwash? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> he needs to coach him up a little bit better, too. Maybe that'll happen. Yes, he does. Maybe that'll happen in Fayetteville, too. You can read more about it on our website, WDRB.com. Go there and click on sports.